everybody, it's Juliana and I am here to share with you guys a couple of things that I created um, using um, some trims and embellishments from Flare by Me Etsy and Melanie has sent me some beautiful products uh, for me to play with and um, I would like to share with you guys some of the things that I made with it. I had so much fun creating with her laces and trims and her beautiful embellishments um, and she has gorgeous items in her store so definitely check it out and I will put the link on the description below but uh, let's go ahead and get started the first thing I did was I altered this um, tissue holder that I had found at my thrift store for 99 cents and um, I alter using the trims and also using some fabric that I had also uh, found at my thrift store and um, if you guys watch my latest hauls, you will see that I purchased this beautiful vintage uh, fabric here. So um, let me go ahead and show you what it looks like. So this is the front of the holder, the tissue holder, and this at the edges. So the fabric that I used, um, it's this one right here, and it's very beautiful. It has like some gorgeous roses. Um, and some vintage colors is very 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 pretty and so I definitely wanted to use it and um, the tissue holder actually had it's all like um, ivory color on all edges besides the front so the front has um, this beautiful like printed rose here and um, I actually made my own um, handmade flower that kind of looked like the rose that was on the bottom here and I left some of the leaves here and the edges so I think this colors right here really inspired me to use that fabric that I had found um, so let me show you what I did so as you can see it is a tissue holder but I'm gonna go ahead and get the tissue box out here so I'll, I can show you um, more easy um, but this is it and like I said this is the front of it um, I made this flower using some fabric from my stash and I used some pearls as well from my stash. Um, I used this crochet flower that Melanie has sent me and I added one right here and one over here as well on the bottom. And then I also added some um, little trims from the fabric and I feel like the fabric really matched the picture from the case here. Um, this trim right over here is just from my stash, so I just put that on both edges on each side. And then um, this is the fabric right here. I cover it with the fabric and then I added this beautiful uh, trim that you can find in her Etsy store. It's so, so beautiful, you guys. Um, and it looks like this. It's very, very beautiful. So I added that trim. Um, all around the tissue holder there you go all around the tissue holder and it just gave it a more uh, shabby look but also it looks very very vintage and you can still see the roses um, from the inside on the top here I also cover it with the fabric and um, this is from the trim as well I made a bow using some fabric from my stash and also the same fabric that I used for the, the cover here. And then I added this beautiful flower that Melanie also has in her store. And they look like this. And they're just very, very beautiful. I love these. Um, so I added that one on the top and just has some little dangles of fabric just kind of falling down from the flower so i really liked how the tissue holder turned out and um i was glad to be able to also use things that i've been finding so that's the tissue holder and i also created um this card right here and this one, this card is for a friend. So um, I just use regular cardstock, car and then I use a lot of her trims in this card. So um, I like to create cards that have 
um, using fabric and laces besides just paper um, and her trims are perfect for these so the trims that I used uh, are this one right here which is what I used for the base of the car and then I also used this one which is very beautiful as well and then I used um, this one right here it's like a bridal trim and it's super beautiful it has all these pearls in them so um, I layered the lace first and I used um, some of the Prima shimmer um, sprays in like a pink color so I give it a really nice uh, soft pink background um, I also added uh, one of the flowers that she carries in her store in white I added some Prima flowers and this is the leaf trim and then this flower right here came from another one of her trims and it's this one right here so I just cut one of the flowers and you can use them individually and I placed that right there with another Prima flower and then the sentiment here that I painted in white and it says inspire so it's a very simple card but um, it's turned out super cute and um, I just use love using the trims and the fabrics for them um, on the inside, I just added a little piece of paper from a Prima collection on the inside where I will write my message. And then I also um, created this. And this is actually um, a little tint, a metal tint. And you can find those at the dollar store. I bought a few that look like this and i made some of some of these for easter as well and they're super fun to alter so i'll show you guys what it looks like it's very shabby looking and um i used some fabric some muslin fabric that i also found at my local thrift store and then i cut up some of this lace that i show you guys for the card and i glued it all the way around the tent I then use some of this beautiful trim here from her store as well right here and then I use some of the leaf trim to kind of create a flower and I added one of her uh, vintage buttons in the middle those are absolutely beautiful you guys are so cute I also use a different trim here for the back of it and it just call, comes all the way down super super cute and then um, this is just some uh, sheer fabric that I had from my stash and I made a bow here for the top and I just gathered some of the fabric and I glued it around on the inside and it's a really really good size like you can fit um, shrimps inside you can fit um, any goodies I think they make perfect little gifts for people when you're sending them a rack or a gift um, they're also perfect for Easter for little um, gifts and so that's what it looks like with laces inside and it's just super super cute so I definitely wanted the little can here and the card to fit together to kind of um, match together as well so that's what I created. I hope that you guys liked it and I hope that you also check out her beautiful store. She has great, great products and I was just so happy to be able to create with them. Thank you so much everybody for watching and I will see you guys all soon with another video. Take care. Bye-bye.